welcome to the very first video of Convergence, a League of Legends story. I'm a pretty big fan of teamfight tactics. I played League of Legends back in the day when it came out. I was... the highest rank I got was uh, Platinum 3 in League of Legends. And yeah, I currently started playing TFT. When I saw this, I was like, I had to play it. So let's see how good this is. If you guys do enjoy, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, and let's get it. We're gonna start game over here. We can choose our difficulty. Let's do heroic. Enemy aggressiveness. Medium, I think we're just, we're just gonna leave everything as is. Man, I'm so excited for this. Hopefully it's gonna be a good one. Jinx is one of the heroes here. Fire just exploded out of nowhere. I better run. Uh, I was supposed to meet Lim up here. I hope it's okay. Dude, it sounds like the voice actor from Miles Morales. Spider Man. So, rolling a circle? Smashed by a falling spire if we don't all get out of here. Oh, yeah. You're gonna have to fight us if you want to get by. Sure. <laughs> Dodge. <laughs> I try to dodge. Can't, well, we can't double jump yet. Yep, just an average day hands on. <laughs> uh, Echo, help! Lim, Lim, I'm coming to get you. <laughs> okay. Why I can't pick this up? Maybe oh, it's, it's my HP. Wait, what's that? Can we go up here? Looks like we can't. Oh my. Hey, Lim! Can you hear me? Echo! I'm scared! I'm here. Oh, we can crouch. Okay. Rewind time, press L2. We're gonna find another way around. Don't worry. So, Echo rewinds time by a few seconds, reversing any damage taken. Rewinds? Users rewind charges. The amount of seconds that can be re rewinded at a time is limited by rewind gauge. Hold L2 to use. Uh, to use, uh, release L2 to return to normal time flow. I need a way to get around. I need a way to get around. Huh. 
Let me retrace my steps. Looks like we can break the floor there. There's an arrow. There we go. Could be a path around. I'll try to go again. Oh boy. You know what? I don't have time for this. Corona break. What? I'm pressing. Ah. Okay, Ether Echo shatters his timeline, returning to a more favorable point in time. He returns into a position of his uh, after image. Enemies near his arrival zone take massive damage. Okay, so press L3 and R3 and use the Chrono Break gauge when it's full. And Echo's after image is uh, present. Damage enemies to refill the Chrono Gauge. Can you hold me out of here? I always do. But I'm so confused. So much, Echo. You know I'd help anyone in trouble. Um, I have to tell you something. You know how you let me borrow your time winder? I lost it. Well, it got stolen. This kid with a giant hammer pushed me around and took it. I'll get it back, Lim. You should run back to the hideout. It's dangerous out here. Thanks, Echo. You're the best. Yeah, at any time, press R3, I guess, to access the map. Use LB and RB, L1 and R1, uh, to navigate between the different tabs. Okay. Uh, your next objective will always be marked on the map. Indicates you have not been explored yet. So, next objective is all the way down there. So, it's quite a long a while to get there. We can't go in there. This image that is running behind us makes it a tiny tad confusing where you are. Chapter 1, Iron and Glass. So we have some stuff to read here. Feel free to pause the video if you want to read the codex. There's the map. We have abilities here also. We only have two abilities right now. Those enemies looks like Heimerdinger. I don't know if you get experience. Pick this up. More stuff to read in the codex. Wow. I assume we don't want to jump here. But we will. Yeah, definitely not. Is this a shop? Yeah. 
There we go. Can't grab anything there. We can't reach that. Let's uh, have a look at the map here. Our objective is right under us. Whoa! It even feels more powerful. Ah! I know just who to try this out on. Hey, are you the ones that pushed Lim? Who took the time winder? <laughs> Maybe. What's it to you? What are you doing with all that orange stuff? Pop some of that orange crystal crap from the spire into the chamber of my armor and whoosh! Ah! It's gonna be good. Is it some kind of Hextech crystal? Those aren't usually orange. I don't know, and I don't care. All that matters is it works! Let me smash uh, if an enemy glows red, their next attack cannot be dodged through. Ah, okay. Okay, Time Winder. Echo throws a disc that expands through time uh, into a time distortion field upon reaching a set distance, damaging enemies caught inside after a delay. The Time Winder rewinds back to Echo, dealing damage to uh, on its return. The Time Winder can also be used to power sockets. Feels good to have my time winder back. Can't let good tech fall into bad hands. Now I'd better head into the market hub. Make sure everyone's okay. The time winder might help. No. There you go. Oopsie. I assume we're going this way. Yo, it does quite a lot of damage though. It does so much damage. <laughs> Busy day for the rising hell. <laughs> what are you throwing at? Okay, so we're here now. We need to get there. So we need to somehow get higher up. Ow. Whoa. 
Okay, yeah, we're into the next zone. I think. Dodge down. Can't get up there, man. Okay. I can't get up there. That was pretty tough, not gonna lie. I don't even know how to pronounce that. Cladiosol? Great Cladiosol? Okay. Returns you to full elf, I think that's what it said. Streets East. Next objective is all the way there. First try. Whoa! There's an enemy. Okay, we're here. My goodness, dude. Ow. Oh, that's a bomb. Dude, I can see this game being extremely hard eventually. It's already getting tough. Clockwork Champion. Return to this 
Carbon for a reward. That took so long to do. But we got it. Return to Ailey to exchange for a Z trail. And we're back here. Okay. Gotta be honest, man. So far, this game is pretty awesome. Always Enjoying it. To see an intro song. there. go yeah we opened that door gate is open <laughs> so we can either go down or up we get past this uh we don't have that ability yet I'm pretty sure we could try. <laughs> if we fail, we just rewind. Yeah, that's for later. We need like wall running or something. The objective is to go left. <laughs> Wait. 
Wait a minute. This is where we were just now. Let's not get up there. Right still, yeah. It seems like it. A little bit confusing, but pretty cool so far. Hey, Red, Axamander, you all right? Hey, Echo. We're totally fine. We were in the hideout when the spire exploded. Just came to see if there was any damage out here. Yeah, we've seen tons of scrappers gearing up to start sorting through the wreckage. It did some real damage to the city, but there's probably some good inventing materials that came from that spire. I hear the Poindestras have been hiring kids to do their dirty work. Not just that. I've seen some guards from Piltover walking around Entrasol today. I think they're down here on a secret mission. Can't they just keep out of our city and mind their own business for once? Maybe I'll have to go take a look at that spire damage myself. Echo! Don't you think you should be careful if there's Pilties and Poindestra prowlers around? Nah, Red. They've got to watch out for me. I should check that my parents' apartment didn't get damaged. Then I'll see you two later. <laughs> Bye, Echo. Bye, have a great time. Go to the apartment. So, read us about them, if you guys are interested. Pause the video. Okay, so which way do we go now? Whoa, dude. Huh. Ellie! Those Poindestra twins evicted you after all? I always thought Drake and Vale were just socialites. Now that they're handling the family business, the way they treat regular people is messed up. Yeah, it's definitely weird. But Corin Revik helped me get us a new spot here, so I'll be close to everybody now anyway. Awesome. Need any help getting set up? Nah, it's okay. <sighs> I've got to sort this stuff first anyway. Nice. Well, I'll catch you later, Ellie. Bye, have a great time. We're a resilient bunch down here, that's for sure. Spire collapse or not, the day must go on. Speaking of which, looks like Corn Revik needs some help. Already stolen enough of my clockwork creations. Leave me alone. Ha! You couldn't catch us if you tried, old man. Is something wrong here? No. We're just, uh, leaving. But you'll be seeing us around, Echo. Who were they? Those twerps have taken my best clockwork figurines and hidden them all around Zon. I won't have anything to sell if this keeps up. I'll keep an eye out for them, Mr. Revik. Thanks, Echo. You're a good boy. I'll give you a few cogs for whatever you can bring me. Deal. See you later. Hi there, Echo. Assume this is the shop. Find Clockwork Champions. Or turn them to corn for rewards. I'll never forget how much you've helped, Echo. Uh, use to craft new gadgets at the workbench or trade them with rugs to learn new skills. Always glad to see you, Echo. <gasps> okay, there's a wall. Yeah, we need to get up there. Hey, Runs. Standing guard? On watch? Gotta stay vigilant, Echo. It's quiet now. But there were a few chem-punk gangs running through here a while back. <laughs> yeah, 
I met some on my way here. There's Clan Pharaoh's guards from Piltover walking around now, too. Can't stand seeing them act all mighty in Zon. You don't need to tell me twice. I've got no love for Pilties. Fair enough. Oh, hey, thanks for letting me borrow these. Grind plates and hook. Wow. So echo special plates under the shoes to, gr uh, to grind it down rails at high speed. Additionally, echo can undergrind by swinging under the rails using the arm mounted hook. Awesome. Press R2 near a rail. To use, use grind up and down to toggle between the grind and undergrind. And no problem. <laughs> the fun, right? They certainly make getting around Entrasol easier. Hey, my inventions always do. See you later, Runks. A spire owned by Kim Barons blows up. Some sort of sparkly orange compound makes super weapons, and now guards are coming down from Piltover? I don't like that. This might not be a typical day in Zon after all. There we go. Easy peasy. Goodness, just the biggest sneeze in the world. Dad are probably fine, but you never know when Zon. It wouldn't hurt to check in on them. Sorry, birdies. Sure. Oh, you won't. beating there. Give me money, bro. Oh! Dude, I can play drums and kill enemies easy. This is the place we need to go. Those are some of the clan Pharaoh's guards my friends were telling me about. What are they doing down in Zon? Is the air in Piltover too fresh today? Could be. Some more about them. Feel free to read this guy's pause a dem video if you are interested. Going to the apartment. Checking if our parents is okay. Today. More documents to read. So, I think there might be a secret up there. Wow, 
Well, we can't reach it anymore. Hey, what are you doing here? <sighs> parents aren't home yet, right? What the hell do you want with my parents? Or me? I'm here because I need your help. Yeah, I don't help people who hide in gardens or spy on my family. Get out of here. Or else. <laughs> Slow down. Seriously? You've got to go. Excuse me. Got him. Our first boss fight, I guess. Now take it. Increase the amount of gauges Echo is equipped at once. Is that HP increase? If you would just listen, I'm not here to hurt you. I'm you. From the future. Wait, what? I invent time travel? Why didn't you just say that? What are you doing here? Why'd you have a hood on? Because it was raining. And because I wasn't sure if you would trust me. I need your help. I'm here to investigate something in the past. The spire collapse? Mmm, smart. I was a bright kid. What's going on? Is it something to do with the Poindestras? Or all the Pharos guards I've seen around today? Echo! You home? Hmm. Now's not going to be a great time to talk. Do you know the Watlick power plant? Yeah, sure. In factory wood. Closed down last year. Totally empty. Well, not for long. Meet me there, and I'll explain everything. Echo! See you soon, kid. Better see what my dad wants. And then go meet up with myself. From the future! Sounds pretty good. I can now equip gadgets to improve his abilities. Go to the workbench to craft new gadgets. Uh, in this screen, you can decide which gadgets to equip. Unfortunately, you don't have any yet. So, it's pretty cool stuff, dude. I mean, I'll read them once we collect them. Where's me dad? Huh? Like we can't collect anything. What's up, Dad? Okay, hmm? gadgets give Echo special perks and modify his current abilities when equipped. Echo can craft new gadgets at workbench using rare parts found in the chest through Zuon. Zhaone. I sure want to craft this gadget. Increase maximum re rewind charges by one, and lengthens how far back time Echo can rewind. Gravity Matrix. Uh, the time winder pulls enemies towards Echo upon returning to him. Love it. That is my triangle ability, if I'm not mistaken. And uh, that's all we could craft for now. It was either that option or this one. Increase the movement and attack speed of a short time after rewinding. 
Uh, once gadgets are crafted, remember to equip them. Hi. Ah, then there were three. Hello, little man. <laughs> you're actually home before us for once. Don't get used to it. I'm glad to see you're both home and safe. That spire collapse was bad. Luckily for us, most of that spire fell in the decommission zone of Factory Wood. All we felt were a few tremors. But we got the rest of the day off work anyway. There's all this orange muck around. I don't know what materials the Poindesters are working with these days, but it's a mess now. It's a shame. The Poindestra siblings are all that's left of that Kimbaran family. And I hear, they're not the nicest people either. I can't stick around, but you sure you two are okay? We'll be just fine. You take care of yourself out there, Echo. Okay. So, Factory Wood's closed from the spire falling on it, and me from the future wants to meet up there. This is getting interesting. Let's check where we need to go. There's my parents. Feel free to read that. Then we have this also. Read this also if you want to. Um, our next objective doesn't show yet. Oh, there. Goodness, it's on the other side of the world, bro. Hey, I remember making these. Maybe they'll come in handy later. Uh, defies gravity to run on walls for a brief period of time. Press R2 near walls. Wow, R2 is like a lot of stuff. It's your grind, it's your grab. Um... <clears throat> it's pretty much everything. Walls now. There we go. We can maybe grab that now. What? Come on, dude. There we go. Fifty cogs. Thank you. Grab these shoes. It's a very, very long way for our next part, though. We're already in chapter two. I almost got it there. I've seen one of those before, and I've always wanted to catch one. Oh, man. Why didn't it jump? Why didn't I jump there? No, man. Are you serious? Go up, dude. We've got an artifact. Return to uh, Axie Manager for a reward. 
Okay. More stuff to read if you want to. Can't go in there. Okay, so our next objective is all the way there, dude. Whoa. Okay, so the closest point is a little bit down. Uh. Looks like you lose HP if you fall too far. Okay, then more to the right. Can't grab that, it's too high. Yeah. You're in a hurry. Something interesting is going on. I'm on my way to the Watlick power plant. Sounds like there could be trouble. Need backup? Not yet, but I'll let you know if it comes to that. Cool. Well, I can at least show you a new move or two. <laughs> Thanks, Rungs. Okay, spend cogs, learn powerful new skills. Uh, from rugs. Skills are uh, permanent and do not need equipment once they are learned. So you can learn this. Echo uh, uses quick reflex to deflect incoming melee attacks. Powering melee attacks successfully will stagger them for a short time. Attacks uh, that flash red cannot be parried. Yeah, I will learn this. We have so much money though. Perfect reflect. Um, a sword bat charge. Echo concentrates power into the sword bat, then deal extra damage uh, with it. Attacks generates a rewind charge. If an enemy is hit. I don't even know what the parry button is, though. Uh, I will take this. We can take one more. Echo thrusts the weight of a sword bat downwards, delivering a heavy drop attack. Echo uh, uses a quick reflexes on coming range attacks. Projectiles reflected by enemies will damage them. Clashing red projectiles cannot be parried. So what is the parry button then? Is there a way to see? Press B before incoming range attack. Okay. Hey Ellie, the shop is looking good. Thanks Echo. Now I just need some inspiration and some dyes. If you spot stuff around Zon that could be used for dyeing fabric, could you pick it up for me? Oh yeah, sure thing. Sweet. I can use them to spice up your look, if you want. Uh, I didn't know I needed a change. <laughs> uh, thanks, Ellie. I might take you up on that. Doesn't hurt to keep things fresh. You know where to find me if you ever want an update. How can I help? So, equip the chroma char uh, change the color of Echo's outfit. I equipped a Z trail uh, to change the, the trail effect the zero, uh, on the zero drive. You can return to her and him, I guess, uh, to Ali uh, to unlock more chromas on the Z trails. Ruined Echo. We have this also. Gotta have style. Equipped at Ali's shop to change the color of Echo's outfit. Look at the color change on him. We can go full gold. That looks so badass. I'm gonna go full gold, it's gonna be easier to spot. Zon is a runway. Style matters. So this is just a 
Okay, it's just an outfit change. So if we go down there, that's definitely not where we're supposed to be. We need to get higher up. I think this is where we need to be. Do not need to go up here. Clockwork champion. Return this to Corrin for a reward. <laughs> so yeah, we don't need to go up there. Okay. How would we jump this? Oh, there. Why did you throw, dude? Okay, it seems like we can't open that fan. going right we need to go lower oh, the cutscene Destra just evicted Ellie we're not paying you to be scaredy rats just go look around Watlick and collect as much Syntixie as you can. Okay. It's just inside? Hmm. Well, a bunch of it crashed and burned through the entire building when this fire fell. So, yes, it's probably somewhere inside. Yes, Miss Poindestra. The Watlick power plant has been empty for a year. And now there's something the Poindestras want inside? Possibly future Echo 2. Sounds interesting indeed. Okay, another loading screen of Doom. <laughs> and this is our next objective. Echo told me to meet him at the Watlick power plant. I wonder if he'll tell me any more about stuff that happens in the future. Factory wood. Hope no one got hurt out here for the spire. Clock of Champion and another one. They're one hit to kill, though. Oh, 
Oh my goodness. Workbench got it. <laughs> uh, that was funny. Give me that money of doom. Okay. Not everyone left factory wood today. <laughs> hmm. A switch? Got it. 50 cogs, thank you. Pretty dangerous place to go. Pretty dangerous place to go to work. Use a workbench. there. We meet at last. Hey there, future me. Haven't seen factory wood like this in a long time. Does it change a lot in the future? It's different. Good different. Bad different? Uh, just different. Look, we can stand around talking about the future later. What I'm interested in now is the past. You sure are impatient for someone with a zero drive. Yeah, well, I guess some things don't change with age. All right. So what are we getting up to today? First, we're going in. And we will be going in within the next episode. Guys, I want to say thank you so much for taking time out of your day supporting the channel by watching it. If you want to support it more, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you are new. I'm looking forward to see you guys in the next one. Love you, take care, and as always, remember to twist some nips. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye, have a great time.